when I got my mission call and knew that I was going to Houston, um, I was definitely curious. I was glad it was a place I'd heard of, so it wasn't weird. Um, but I definitely wanted to know what the weather was like and um, I guess what... I knew I was Spanish-speaking, so I had the thought cross my mind of how many actually Spanish speakers there were there, if I'd have to speak English a lot or, or what that would all be like. Um, but... I didn't really study much or try to figure it out really before I left. I just knew I'd figure it all out when I got there. After high school, I decided to go down to Southern Utah University. And while I was there, I had a roommate who, my first weekend there, I was asking my roommates if they were if they were going to go to church. And I had one roommate that told me she wasn't Mormon, but that she wanted to get baptized. And so I was like, well, really? Do you want, do you want me to meet? Uh, have you met with the missionaries? And she said, no, do I have to do that? And I kind of explained to her that they would just teach her a little bit. And then if she decided that she wanted to get baptized, that she would be able to do that. So I got in contact with the missionaries for her. And that whole semester, they were coming over to our apartment and they were teaching her. And me and my other roommates got to be a part of that whole process of watching the missionaries teach her and watching her conversion and helping to answer her questions about the church and about the doctrine. And um, it was a neat experience to have. And then the mission age change was made in October, and I turned 19 the following March. And so between that time, I had always wanted to go on a mission growing up, and with that experience that I had there and then the mission age changing, it just all worked out perfectly, and I decided to go.